Hi, this is Info Puppet, and we're gonna look at the magic of content aware. You are absolutely gonna love my next Photoshop Elements tutorial. Photoshop Elements 12 is open up. This is where to find Photoshop Elements 10 and Photoshop Elements 11. These are the images that we're working on. And we're going to grab the Spot Healing Brush Tool. Now the Spot Healing Brush Tool is the first tool that kind of taught us about Content Aware. And let's just show you what Content Aware does. It makes the program aware of the pixels around where you're highlighting so that if you want to get rid of an unwanted shadow, well, you can click and release or left click, hold and drag. Let's say you're looking at this image and you're like, well, we can't have any distractions from this girl's face. Look at this thing up here. It's weird. Let's get rid of it. Now it's gone. What about this ridge? This can't be here. See how quick it goes away? And now let's look at the other image. This is even more powerful. The client didn't want a big tree in the middle of his mountains. Get rid of that tree. He's not going to be happy. Your client will be mad. Boom. It's gone. I'm going to do some touch up work right here. And there. And well, we still have the tree stump. Let's get rid of that. And boom. But the mountains don't look right. Well, left click, hold and drag. And perfect. All right, so let's move on now to the newest edition of Photoshop Elements 12, the Content Aware Move Tool. Love that name. Make sure the first square is selected and the mode is in Move. All right, now we're going to draw a kind of a line, left click, hold and drag around this rock. Move it over, maybe I want a better view of the waterfall. Now Photoshop Element goes to work to figure out what should be under the rock and look at that! That is awesome! Well, that's not enough. Let's move this rock over a little bit further. I really want to see this waterfall. Photoshop Elements is analyzing. Look at that! Now, we do have a little bit of some problems. Um, there's kind of weird triangles up here. So that's okay. I'm going to grab the Clone Stamp Tool and take care of that stuff right over here. All right, if you don't know how to use the clone stamp tool, click on that tutorial right there. It's a clone stamp tool tutorial. Do it, click on it now. All right, so that looks a little bit better. So now what we're gonna do is we're going to go back to the content aware move tool and I'm going to draw a line around this guy. I'm going to make sure I get a shadow. I'm just left clicking, holding, and dragging. Because my client wants these two people further apart. They want to place some text in between the two people. Okay, so now I'm going to release. Let Photoshop Elements do its work. And boom, look at that. Photoshop Elements just drew the beach in where the guy was. Unbelievable. All right. Now we're going to go to the Clone Stamp tool, and there's a little reflection here i got to get rid of. And now we're back to the Content Aware tool, and I'm going to move the girl now. I'm going to make sure I can make sure I got her shadow also. And I'm just left clicking, holding, and dragging. And Photoshop Elements will now do its work. It's thinking, it's figuring out what pixels to put where she was. And boom! Look at that! Now, now that they're pretty far apart, I can take my text, if I'm making a flyer or a website, and place it in between the two subjects. As you see, I'm getting rid of some of those shadows. With the clone stamp tool, there's my text in between the two subjects. They're kind of looking at the text now, instead of each other. Each other. Alright, let's do some before and afters. So let's go ahead and look at before and after 
and before and after. All right, now you're really gonna love what's coming up next. So let's go ahead and uh, we're gonna work on this image right here. But let's go ahead and go down and change the mode from move to extend. Now, I'm just going to grab, uh, draw a big rectangle around this girl on the left here. And this is extend. And what it does is it makes a copy of your subject, a seamless copy. There it is. I just made twins! Alright. Well, wait a minute, what happened to her foot? Ah! Well, the tools aren't perfect. So, I'm going to go ahead and grab the crop tool and, you know, when in doubt, crop it out. That's what I always say. Alright, now, one more thing that's important. I'm going to grab the content aware tool again. And I'm just going to draw a circle around this girl, move her over, and, man, I'm telling you, Look at this! This is like every guy's worst nightmare! The beautiful women are multiplying! It's like Attack of the Beautiful Content Aware Beach Girls! Ah! What is a guy gonna do? I don't know, it's a scary thing, I'm gonna have nightmares for years! What? Ah! No! No, no! Thank you so much for watching. Do me a favor, leave a comment from Info Puppet.